So we have one of my very closest friends, Amina. Thank you so much for coming by. Thank you. You look absolutely amazing. You have your beautiful daughters. Thank you for saying that because I don't feel amazing. I'm always like when I'm in mommy mode, it's like my kids first. And then I always don't have time to do this or that. So, but thank you. Yeah, you're like super mom. I mean, you take them wherever they go, you know. So that's great. Thank you. Yeah, I try. Um, at least like, you know, when they're not in school, they're with me. So they're part of me. So wherever right. I go, they go. They're your seeds. Yes. Mommy duties. Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. So what is going on with my Amina? What's new? Well, um, you know, I'm just like living the life. I'm trying to like focus on my happiness at this time. You know, my kids, of course, always come first. But um, my music is still my main thing in my life. Um, I have a new album coming out in October. I just dropped a song called Been There, Done That. And the next single, Drinks On Me, is out now. So um, I'm kind of like dropping song by song and then kind of to get people excited for the album because I really feel like really strongly about this um, project. And, you know, I've been releasing music basically every year since 2000 and I don't know, 11 as an independent artist. So, um, yeah, I'm excited about this um, album. And I also another project that I'm working on is my book, my next book, my second book. Um, it's a lifestyle book for women, and it is almost ready for publishing. Um, so um, I'm excited. It's called My Dishes and More. That's dope. I'm so excited about that book. What can we um, expect in the book? Are you going to get into your life details? Mm-hmm. Well, you spill some tea because uh, I do have my cup ready and warm. <laughs> what you can expect is everything. Like everything that you see about me. If you do follow me on social media, everything you see um, that I post is basically a reflection of my real life because, um, you know, I like to like be who I am at all times. And so, you know, a lot of women have asked me over the years all these things, how I got into yoga, fitness, um, my food. That's why it's called My Dishes. Oh, someone singing. Um, I started writing a recipe book because people kind of were so interested in, like, the foods that I post on social media and things like that. So I started out as a recipe book, and then I added all these other elements, and then it just became so much more than that. So that's why the title, My Dishes and More, um, I included, like, just lifestyle tips on how to balance, like, being a mom and, um, you know, working career and how to, in all of that, because it does become stressful, like, how to remain... um, Happy because that's kind of like what's important that you're um, that you enjoy every day, even when you have a lot to do, and that, you know, even when it's everything is stressful and overwhelming, and how to kind of balance that and keep the peace and you know positive energy in your life. So um, it's just a thirty day lifestyle guide where women or anybody can follow what I do and those little tips and tricks and foods and workouts um, that I do um, to yeah feel better about themselves and. No, I, I know it's kind of hard. Sorry, Jacob. No, I know it's kind of hard um, because you're doing all of this by yourself. Yes. Um, you're a, 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 a single parent with yes. two girls, yes. not a boy and a girl, but two girls. And I know that can be a handful. So I salute you for you. just doing everything that you're doing. You're, you know, an author, uh, an artist, and then you're into the yoga, th- you know, and, and, yeah. and doing your, I seen a, a video you were with your sister um, working out. And it's just like, how do you find all this time? And it, but I mean, obviously, you bring your girls with yeah. you when you go to work. <laughs> so I, I mean, I know it can be very, very stressful to yeah. have your kids with you everywhere you go and with no kind of help. So I, I salute you on that. Thank you. You know, and, and it's crazy how not all men, but men put down women. It's just like we're out here struggling and single parents out here with kids then with no help, and they're still like fighting to do everything in their daily lives, oh, plus yeah. their career, plus extra. Mm-hmm. So I, I get it, man. Like my mom went yeah. through the same thing as when I was young. My, my dad is in my life now, but when I was right. younger, it was hard on her. So yeah. I, I salute you. You're you're Thank you're, you're so the, a trooper, man. It like, is super tough. And that is exactly why I wanted to do this book, because um, it may look like on my social media, it may look easy. And people always, oh, you make it look so easy. You're like always happy and like, I'm not. And that's the hardest part is, is to stay happy. It, exactly. Like, yeah. I just try to, like, whatever it is I'm going through, just try to, like, find the positive in it. And that's basically the secret to, like, you know, you always have to look at the good in a situation. Um, and I used to not know how to do that. And then I kind of over the years figured that out, especially when my kids came. And 
But you know, everything you do does take longer. I have to say that um, uh, everything is at slower pace. Like these projects that I'm working on, it takes me. It has t- taken me a long time to like even complete the book, and um, or even like you know, things like recording. Um, I mean, I'm lucky that I can work from home. I recorded my entire album at home. Dope. I have you know made sure that I. Um, got myself some good equipment and then I have a, a nice workstation at home where I can record a whole album. Um, so that is good. But at the same time, I always have to wait till they go to bed at night or like, you know, of course, in the background, like screaming. So around. do you, when, when do you find the time to sleep? Like I, I know, right. <laughs> I, I do sleep is one thing that I have to make time for because it is so important. It's also in my book. It is so important for me to be able to function, you know, so I have to make sure I sleep. Um, so I kind of cut on other things. I don't watch TV or shows or anything. I right. really like, you know, do things like that. And I also cut time like going out. I don't go out really much. I see. Um, uh, because you somebody's know, bit, I, I rather I somebody know. salty over there because you haven't been out. <laughs> <laughs> I do miss it though sometimes, but um, I, yeah, I hardly go out. I don't watch anything. Um, you know, so um, when my kids go to bed, I don't like. Oh, now I have time for myself. I, Sometimes I do need a moment and just like listen to music or something. Yeah. But mostly my thing to go to is be productive and do a little something, even if it's just for an hour. Oh, like I know this album is going to be fire because you're yeah. going through so much. You know, oh when people God. are going through stuff mm-hmm. and trying to stay positive stuff and, and yeah. they spill all their emotions onto their music. So I know mm-hmm. this, this album is going to be great. And yeah. You put your blood, sweat and tears in it. And, you know, sometimes you got to make those necessary sacrifices yeah. in order to, to, you know, create something great and successful. And a lot of people can't have that um now, a lot of people don't have that discipline that you have, and I admire that discipline because even sometimes with me, I do a million and one things, and sometimes I have to just sit at home and just really focus, and it's so hard for me, but I can only imagine. I mean, you have two beautiful daughters. You have to manage being mommy. Then you have to write, and then when mm-hmm. they're sitting down, then you got to go record. You got to oh, work yeah. out in the morning. You take them to school. You got <laughs> a whole bunch of things going on, and I salute yep. you hands down Man, i'm so proud of you i've known you for years now and i see the growth in you it's just so amazing the confidence like you are just a total different woman it's like you're the bad i'm, la- I'm glad you see that because yeah. i feel different too and but i feel in a good place even though yeah. i am still struggling with things and everything is not like going peaches and cream yeah. That's, yeah so but i feel so good about where i am in life who i've become and mm. you know i just feel Free to, and that's kind of what I figured out too. Um, that's what I need to, in order to be happy is my freedom to do me and to do what I want. And even if it's hard, I'm still happier that way than to, you know, be kind right. of like head down or mm-hmm. someone else's instructions, especially as an artist. <laughs> right. Yeah, exactly. Because yeah. I know sometimes um, in the industry when you can do music, people want you to do a certain way, have the oh, certain yeah. look. I've in been the there. Industry period. Been there, done I'm that, bad. just like your song. Mm-hmm. What you guys have to listen to is amazing. So is my Amina dating? Um, because we saw online. Oh my God, I knew that was good. <laughs> Juicy. We the tea. saw yeah, online. You know, um, I am dating, but um, it's it's kind of not as easy as you know as you as it always looks to me like everyone's always like oh they got a new boyfriend like that and for me first of all it took a long time for me to even be open to dating but now I am. And um, it's still like I my standards are higher now and I'm like more picky and it's it has to be it doesn't have to be perfect because nobody's perfect. But, it you know, I'm like perfect for you. Yeah. If there's something that, I you know, I just don't take no, you know, no. No, no, no ish. Yeah. Because you've been there and done that. Exactly. So you're not going to do that exactly. again. Exactly. That's why the song Been There Done That. My other song that I dropped in February, Boy Bye, was also more towards anyone new from here on out yeah because now i'm like you know it's kind of it kind of sucks because in a way um my people in the future that may date me may have it harder for sure because I well am, we saw i know what i deserve you know now and I, I i always knew that but i was stuck you know people have seen me on tv and everything being stuck on someone and after you get through that you you don't you, go back back that. never you don't do that so the gentleman you posted a picture with, are you guys dating? Um, let's just leave it up in the air for now. <laughs> because, you know, I'm not on TV right now. I don't feel like I need to... S- you know, I posted it and I care about him. He's actually the producer of my new album. I met him before. Super He's a talented. very kind, I, I man. care about him very much. Um, and um, we've created some of my best work ever. And um, so, yeah, I, I, 
I definitely care about him, but um, I don't want to put a title to it, you know? Right. You're just going with the so, flow. I like that he's not no punk B-I-T-C-H because I've seen that um, <laughs> the the situation where, you know, your your daughter's father and him yes. and he was taking up for you. Yes. And I, I like that. He wasn't no punk. He ain't going to let, let nobody talk to he his woman care or, the, yeah. you know, his his some, someone who he cares about right. any old kind of way. And oh, then, you know, sure. it looks like... Let me see that. <laughs> Let me see the phone. Oh my god. Yo. You had ample enough time to say what you Um are. it's just yeah, someone that's been is close to us um in every way cuz you know my music is me, so that always kind of mm. is you know goes together. But what I took out of that is that you don't owe anybody an explanation, so you never have to explain anything to anybody, especially right. when you're taking care of your kids over here in Los thank Angeles, you, California you. by yourself when your baby daddy's in New <laughs> yes. York. I don't want to hear nothing, okay? <laughs> Thank because, you so much. Yeah, because you have to handle business, and you know sometimes you get invited to things you can't go, you know, because your your children are your priority. So if you're that mad, come on down and watch them while I go to this event. dot com. Mm. But anyways, I mean, I <laughs> have watched you perform live, and sometimes you listen to artists' music, and it's and you go to their concerts and you hear them live, and it's sometimes it's a little disappointing. Mm-hmm. I've never been disappointed with Aww, you. Oh, thank you. When I go to your performances and you perform, everything that you hear on audio, you're gonna hear live as well. It's thank natural so talent. Much. That's dope because you know a lot of people can't do that. It's all yeah. that auto tune and different voices. Oh, and I hate auto tune. And, something and, I and, and then in li- live is. Very boring, and it's just like, okay, well, this is not the keep that same energy, sis, in the studio. Like, you know what I mean? That's dope. (laughs) It's crazy that you say that because, I mean, it's it's a great thing, but I personally, I'm never satisfied. Like, when I watch a performance of mine back, I'm like, ah, I never like it. But that's how we uh, elevate. We're all like that on ourselves. You're hard on yourself, but you do a good and you get the crowd um, involved, which I like too. Thank you. You know? So it makes it a whole like little fun experience when right. you go out and do things. Good. Yeah, I need to do that more. That's the plan. Um, hopefully getting on a tour and things like that. By the, by the way, the album's called After Dark. Um, After Dark, okay. Which is, you know, kind of speaks for itself, but it has two meanings. Um, it's like definitely a grown and sexy album. Oh, so it's going to be some like sexy songs yes. on there. Oh, Ooh. you know, that's my favorite. You yeah, know, that's right. sure, <laughs> sure. Um, and right. it's kind of different from what I've had before. Like Mother, my previous album was like my growth album. And this one is kind of a reflection as always like of where I am right yeah. now. Um, you know, ready for something new. And like, um, it's definitely also After Dark. Also the meaning um, for me is, you know, after you come out of a dark period in your life. Mm. Who, you, who you are now yeah. you and that deep. is kind of what the album is as well so yeah I'm excited about it I love the new single everybody Amina's new single is out right now um, let them know where they can hear it we're gonna put the link to it right here so you guys need to go buy that right now you gonna, so do, I you gonna two, boom it? yeah I dropped two songs in two months so the newest one is Drinks On Me out now um, and everyone's been waiting for it like at least the people that you know do follow me um, I've been posting snippets on like my story and things like that and everyone's like when is this one coming out and so I decided to drop it I was gonna wait till the album comes out but I was just like let's just put it out now and then you know have kind of more of a, a warm up for when the, when the final project is ready but as a matter of fact you guys get to listen to a little bit right now here here's a clip <laughs> For my lovely no, Amina. I'm good. I, I yeah. didn't want to get in too deep because uh, you know I already you know asked her a few things and about the mommy situation because I can relate because I was oh, yeah. one of the babies that my mommy mm. was taking care of. My so mother too. I, I just wanted her to you know basically you know state that of how hard it is because it's not easy it is, and everybody yeah. thinks it's easy. She said you know that which is good that she makes it looks e- look easy. Yeah. But being that she's doing so much and then you have two daughters and you have. You know, you're doing your book and you're, you're you know, you're you're working out and and yeah. and and your album and it, it's just like, damn, like how how? It is, so it is. I'm glad you're doing a, a book to say how yeah, to yeah. teach these either young, you know, it's the young women out there that are having kids and they're you're probably, you know, I'm sure that they're right. looking at you like, oh my, like I'm going through the same thing. You so you're probably gonna help a lot of lives out there. So thank you. you know, I'm hoping I'm, to. It's like inspiring is like my favorite thing to do and like. Just by sharing my life and even just like photos on IG or whatever, like it seems like women are so inspired by just seeing positivity. So that's why, even though I do, I do have those moments where I'm like totally like you know I even cry and everything, but it's like 
You're Who human. Who wants to see that? I, I wouldn't post that just because at the end of the day, nobody cares. And, like, and then they're going to be like, oh, she just wants sympathy. No. Right. Exactly. Yeah, so I, I like yeah. to post Facts. the inspiring, positive things. But at, they are real. You know, they are my real life. So it may look like it's all that, but it's just that, you know, we don't like to show that. Right. But you put what you go through in your music, and that's what Absolutely. people can relate to, and that's what Facts. people respect. And Facts. I do talk about a lot of the struggles in the book and... See, Those I cannot wait till the book is coming out. <laughs> yeah. You know when the book is out, and I'm, we're going to promote it here on the Sentinel for Speaks. Sure. Um, but I want to thank you so much from the bottom of my heart yes, for coming thank out. You, Amina, for you sure. could have been doing a million one things. I know you're a busy woman, but um, no, I've been waiting to come here. You know, uh, yes, you are my girl, and thank you so much. And everybody, you maybe guys we can do an update after oh, she puts yes. out. After both, you know what both I mean? Are out. Yeah, we have let's to do an update. Me? Mother oh, is man. out now. The album. If you don't have it, go buy it right now. Yes, Excuse and my me. singles been there, done that, and drinks on me. Been there, done that, and then drinks on me. Hey. Not on me when we go to the club, but drinks on Amina. Yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, now I'm, I'm done. <laughs> well, I'm, going, I'm right. going to the club too, then. You know right. I mean? Drinks on me.